driving past, seen a couple of these chairs. I'll take them. Oh yes, I'll definitely take those. We're on our way. Nothing in that one. Oh, there's a can there. Take that. Um, we're actually on our way to our honey hole. She said funny chairs that go around in circles while you wheel on it. So yeah, we'll um, take these out to our honey hole. They're not a bad looking chair actually. All steel. Oh dear. Chuck it in the back here. There's one. And uh, yeah, we'll see what we can get out of our honey hole. Still in town at the moment. Go and see what we can get. Oh, it's true to life. Keep moving. First, before we have a look in there, see if there's any change. No change. What have we got in here? Oh, yes, that's a big change. Right, we'll get in that glove up, back up, all the good stuff. We will get into there. Oh, yeah, hell yeah. Get some bargains to be had in there. A lot of cans. All that sort of stuff. Anyway, get in there, I suppose. We'll grab our chairs out. Pull our good looking chairs out. Put them aside. Oh, it's true, they've got some weight in these. That one, that side. They're funny shape, really. Real funny shape. We might put them on the hard top when we're finished. Not put them in with the recycles. Oh, cripes. Right, that one is not, I don't think it's a 10 center. No, no. Florida, US. Hey, well, you Florida people, there you go. Comes all the way over to Oz. Good old Oz. But it don't get recycled as a 10 center. But anyway, we've got our chairs out. I might open that up. There. There's one. A bit of alfoil. Right, I'll just chuck this straight over. Into there. That one there. Got nothing in it but looks of it. No. Stray over. Straight over. Play basketball with that. That one straight over. Oh shoot, gotta get up. Two. Bit of alfoil. Probably only give me a short video for the day. I don't usually do this one during the day, it's usually in the morning or, or late in the afternoon, so it's only midday at the moment. Put that one over there, don't look like there's much in that. That over there too. Oh, that feels heavy. Very heavy. Uh, what are we going to do? We're going to go right to the bottom of this, so we're going to have to put some aside. Just pull it aside. That's how we can sort it out. Just 
so we can get right down to the bottom. There's a wine bottle. Put that there. That one's already gone, done for. Grab that one. Someone had a party. Party, party, party. Is that a 10 center? Yes, that one is. Someone definitely had a party. What have we got here? Some sort of sheet, is it? Yeah, it's a white sheet. Don't look too bad, actually. Bit of a wash. Oh, they used a sheet for their for their tablecloth. It might have been a tablecloth. Anyway, we'll, we'll grab it. We shall grab it. That over there. Now for the tray. Get out. Don't want you. Go away. Come on, get out. Oh, there's more underneath it. More paper. That there. Right. Pull him up. Over there. Now we can get into the soup. Tread on the foam. Grab the can. What have we got in the box here? I'm gonna get rid of the box. Yep, get rid of the box. Toss it next door. Make a bit more room. That over there. A can. That over there. Well, that one's going to go upside down. What a mug. Teacup. Saucepan. Yay! <laughs> Don't mind coming to my honey hole. It's always a mystery what you find. That one way over there. Still making room. I'm trying to make room. There's a gas can there too. Oh, that one's not going to go. Next lot there. Right, get rid of that. Oh. Over there. That one over there. That in there. That one in there as well. Where's the neck on that? Right there, we don't want to chip it out. Not as such yet. Let's jump there, son. Another one there. Still making a bit of room. Got to make a lot of room, really. A lot of stuffy. That is tough. Oh, there's a jug. There's a joke, joke, joke. I'll take the cord. We'll deal with the cord later. This one here. Over in that corner. What's this bag got? Deal with the small ones. Nothing in there, nothing there. Have a look through. Yes, there's one there. Nothing else there. You can usually see through the clear ones, but these dark ones you can't. As everyone knows. Set that up there. We're making headway. We're getting there. Yes, we'll take that. It might look like I'm grabbing that much, but we've got to make headway back into this corner. We know this one was empty. Right. Basically had nothing in it. Look through the bag. Looks like all cardboard. Yep. Tossing that way. I'll pick that up too. Very soon. Grab that bottle. Holy. He's naked. Right, we'll start pouring them out here. In the corner. Oh, wire. We will take whatever's there. Take that. They've already done the deed for me. Took it out of the casing. That's the good stuff, that. Hell yeah. 
And it's definitely taken out of the casing. Nothing left in that casing. Well, there's one. Uh, sort that out. Sort him out. Get him out of there. I can't use my gloves with these. There we go. I don't usually wear gloves doing wire. It's too fiddly. That's that one. Another one there. I'll take the wire for sure. Another one there. Another one there. Pop box for wire. That one done. Yeah, he's done. That's not. I think that goes. Yes, that goes. That one there goes. Grab that little bit. That was a good point. Well worth the effort, that. Oh, grab you. Come here. Put you down in this corner. Oh, yes. Honey holes delivering. For sure. Oh, there's a full can of gas there. Tell you. Put that aboard. It's one thing we haven't had to buy. Yes. Been good that one. This one got gas in it? No. It's empty. Empty. That can be nothing else here. Nope. Right, we will get into that little blue one. There's two. Nothing else there. Nope. This one, or oh, we go to this one. Just get him out of the road for a second. Put him up here. This one there. That's the jug. We'll toss him over next door. It's only got an element in it. It's only go through as what would you call it? Um, pressing steel. So yeah, oh, spider web in my eye. Wine bottle. Even with a ribbon. One more. Doggy tray there, we'll take that. Nothing else out of that one. Or was he? No, there wasn't. That's a no. That's a no. What was that? Oh, okay. It's all food scraps, we'll look at it, a little bit of alfoil, grab that. Nothing there. Grundies, Grundy undies, alfoil. Someone really sorted their rubbish here. But we really went through that. That one. That's all food scraps. Peeled by the weight. Put that one up there. Right. Got you. Put you on top. Oh, that's got some in it. Oh, yeah. 
There we go. Oop, missed that, didn't I? Missed the ship. Oh, I've never seen that one before, but it's got 10 cents on it. Doesn't feel real good. It does not feel real good at all. Feels real slushy. Slushy wet. <sighs> Got some bottles in it though. Get up there and stay there. Get up there. the way. Just never know what you're going to get. Oh, I might start into one of these others here that's close. Like this big one. Did I do that one? I don't think I did. Well how about because we're running out of room up the front empty you out. What do you got in there? Jack Daniels, thank you. Nothing else. Two men hurdles eaten by the mice. A bit of mice. Bit of a mice plague, I reckon. Grab this one. Certainly running out of room. Oh, we'll find our way around our stuff. Ooh, there's a bottle down there before I lose it. Before it goes down to the deep of the rest of the stuff I'm pouring out. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Gas can, test it first. Nothing in it. Chuck it that way so I don't pick it up again. Same as that one. Three, another three, that's 60 cents. It is hard work, but it pays in the end. That's all I'm looking at. I wouldn't keep doing it if it wasn't paying in the end. Another gas can, empty. The old saying goes, look after your senses, the dollars will look after themselves. I stand by that. Over this way, this one there. Oop, still got one inside. No, it's an eggshell. Here it is. Told you there was one in there. Tray. 
pan. Got the bottles. Sweet. Bottles up right there too. Look at that. Another bottle top. Whoop, I missed it. Where'd it go? Down there. An aluminium bottle top. It's the only reason why I'm grabbing it. I know from viewing the comments and that sort of thing, what I tread on, um, a lot of the other dumpster divers don't like going through trash like I do. Um, I've always thought, gotta get your hands dirty. Your hands aren't dirty. I don't think I'm earning a quid. That's just me though. No, I um, think I've always brought up, your hands aren't dirty. I'm not doing the right job. That's the way I was brought up. So that's why this stuff doesn't faze me. I've worked in slaughterhouses, that sort of thing, abattoirs, same thing. Um, yeah, you see a lot of blood and glory there. Uh, a lot of maggots, a lot of the fish food. And um, so yeah, that's why it doesn't really faze me much. It doesn't worry me at all. I just get on with the job. Um, my actual first job was starting out straight out of school as car detailing. I didn't really like it, but it was a job. I uh, wanted to be a mechanic. Just a bit of insight on what I used to do in my younger years. I'm talking about 30, 30 odd years ago, 30, 40 years ago. And um, yeah. Then I uh, went from that to shearing, bounce abouting, wool pressing, all that sort of thing, hard work. So then that stopped and um, yeah, had to work with my father. I'll tell you what, that was hard work, cutting wood. Getting out real early in the morning. Getting out there, cutting nearly a hundred ton a day it's unreal it learnt me a lesson now miles of the day all that sort of thing what the devil we got in that a bit of burnt old charcoal potato um, so yeah that's why I don't really worry about it yes and that's why I'm a hard worker as, a, as you've all noticed in some of the, the videos I get in and get it done It's just something about myself. Hard work, you've got to work for hard, um, and earn, earn a living. Hard work is not given to you. Well, it's given to you in effect, but um, there's a couple there, but you've got to work for it. You know, it's the way the world, the way the world turns. I'll take the top off that. Is that plastic, is it? I can't get that off. No, it's not plastic. I might take the neck off that too. I hope everyone understands what I mean though. If you don't get out there and do it. Sort of thing. It's like a job well done, it's a job well earned. That's 
when I try to find whatever I can. When I can. Even if it's only a little bit. Every little bit adds up. Doesn't matter how long it takes you to get it. Or how dirty of a job it is. I don't class this as a job. Bit of a sideline thing for me. You know, earning a bit of a quid and in the meantime keeping and trying to keep it out of landfill. Which is two ways really, while you think about it. Oh, the bottle top there, I just about missed it. Oh, I did miss it, there it is. Oh come back here butterfingers. Alright, that's that bag. This is a soft bag. I'll tear into this one. Oh. What have we got in this? Bags after bags. Bags after bags. It's paper. Just paper. Paper, paper. Oh, there's a bottle. There's a bottle. There's a can. Right, toiletry stuff. Golf ball. Nothing in that. Okay. Absolutely nothing in that. That made that easy. Right, drag uh, this one out of the road over to the back so we can get this one up. Yep, that's the go. Oh. Let go. What is it? It's an orange. Should go, doesn't go. Okay, over that way. In there. Goes. Oh, I bet you that's an iPhone cord. Good guess. They always keep them rolled up. <laughs> Whew. What a hot day. Oh, someone got a good present. Nothing there though. Go that way. Oof. Not there. That one alpha. That's one bottle. A couple of cans. A couple of bottles. There's always something, always something on the bright side of life. Yeah. Next one. Tell me if I miss any. Surely. Just leave a comment. What do we have to do? If I miss any, well, I may be able to get it next week. I don't know. Leave that one. I don't know. It's a lot of digging to do that. It's truth of life. There's a can. Ooh, that's got a lot of ash in it. That's got a lot of ash. There's the cans there. Get that lot. Pull the can in the bag. Come on, where's the opening? There. Have a look at that guest can too. Oh, Struth. Hop off there. It's got gas in it. Yee hee. That's about another week and a half, I guess, for us. Uh, grab that one. As a can, as a can, as a can, as a can. Here right. you over here. I think that's only ash. Yep, only ash. Ash to ash. Okay. 
grab you. Underneath. Where's the bottom of the bag? Right there. Cord. Yes, thank you. Oh, what's that? A portable jug. 12 volt. Okay, we'll just pop that out the side. Apparently they're big pouch chewers, those things. The hungry, thirsty things. Gas can. Empty, chuck it that way. No, I'd probably oh, take that. They're used, but they're aluminium. Oh yes. Oh, there's another one. So don't dispose of your your little tea tea candles. They're aluminium everyone. Here's another couple. Well oh, that's a full one. Still a bit left in those. You melt them out, make a big candle. Another two there. That's a short break, wasn't it? Another gas can. Got a little bit in it. Still enough. Cook one slice of toast. Oh, we're not going through that. That's kitty litter. <laughs> Hell no! That'd be a smelly mess. Big smelly mess. Okie dokie, let's come over here. Stack it all on one side. There's one. Nothing there. Is that a steel coating? No. Plastic. Let's put the tray in there. That's all that's in there. Oh, that's a big bottle. It's definitely not a tan centre, though. No. Shame. Whew. Just about to take the jumper off. Getting that hot. Paper lined with our foil. Oh, there's one. Right. Ooh, that sounds like a bottle down there. It certainly is. Right, we're getting there, we're getting there, only got this corner to go and we're done. Done, done like a dinner. Alright, so we can start filling the back. Filling it up. There's two, three, four, and some more. There's a big gas can. Empty. Shouldn't be in here really. Should not be here. But it is. There's another one. That's got gas in it. We can go that way. Oh, that sounds good. Sounds like the money. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Big one and done for this today. There's a fair few in that bag. Definitely one and done. It's not as mad as I thought it was, but I'm cleaning the honey hole out. And if you notice, I've got no trash around me. 
trying not to get it on me. Gets a bit hard to get it off ya. Go home smelly. Oh. Get in this one. Got a fair bit in it. Try to keep it over in one area. And the bag empty out, well, stand clear. Nothing there. And they threw the cake away. They had enough. Certainly had enough cake. Looks to be a rich cake. Yeah, bottle here, take that one. Get the neck off it anyway. Alright, how am I going to get to that? Get that out of the road. Thank you. Boom, I'll pop it. Yeah, bugger it. <coughs> I'll the eyes are squinting. <laughs> Thinking that it was gonna pop. Get the hands. Grab that. Get rid of the meat. That's a wine bottle. It's got aluminium on it, but I'll tear it off. There for a second. <sighs> All right. Bottles up. Thank you. Burnt can. Where's the barcode? Me may go through. May may not. We'll give it a squash. Put it in the aluminium squash area. Oh, a fair few in there. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wow. Soft landing pad now. Right there. Something heavy in there. Something heavy. That's no. Ooh, smelly too. Whew. Smells like a dead fish. It is too. Sit that there. Couple of dead fish. Ooh. Holy dooly. They are on the news. Grab that there. Couple of European carp. They're a real pest here. We're not allowed to put them back in the water. We get a fine. Big hefty fine. If we do, if caught. So 
So a lot of them end up in landfill. They decompose. There is um, some commercial fishermen that actually hunt them for, food, for uh, food fertilizer too. Tip that over. One there. Two there. Nothing else there. Here, there. Right. Empty. No. Jeez, I squashed that one. Get an alpha there. Something in that wine bottle. Oh, wine bottle. That's plastic. Plastic one. There. Holy dooly, holy dooly. Oh, my best just to lift that out. Do it up there. bag here. That's why I pulled those bags out. And you had it in the bag here. What was thinking, how do I remember that? Go in a circle, memorize what you left behind. We got a fishing rod in here or something steel. We'll take the steel. It's an old curtain rod. We'll take that. It's still money. Heads up. Empty. Oh, does it work? Does it work? Got any gas in it? It does work. Empty. Right. Looking good. Geez, that's a full carton of custard. What's wrong with it? Has it been opened? Yeah, it's been opened. Good. Right. Get out and do these couple of bags as I can. Do these couple of bags. Ready, ready, up, 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 up. Oh, up. Uh, 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 do, uh, don't do that. Boss the popper. Right. They can come off there, they can go into there, they can go into there, they can go into there, that one there. Do a bit of a sort out. Get out of there. Right. Stuck into these. Go there. Must have been a kids' party or something. Go over 
ね。Don't go sign bag. That it. Get the bag of toss. It's mainly all drinkable stuff. There's another one. Sometimes that's the quicker way to do it. Bring the bags out. Especially here anyway. Certainly made a mess in there, eh? Anyway, finish it off. Just two over there, up there. there. Oh, that's got a top on it, has it? Yes, it has. Take the top. Got nothing on it. Foil. One there. Oh, what's that big? Certainly empty that out. Well, anyway, I'll get to and clean up around here and um, start into these wine bottles. We've got, got a whole heap of cans, cartons, plastic. I reckon there's more glass natural cans but then again sometimes it weighs itself out on what is what like um, when you've got a two litre well even this one's a three litre and I've usually got to squash them down so that they look like a two litre but they're all registered as the same thing this lot uh, they're an orange juice orange and mango uh, they're all got the same barcode, two litre, three litre, they're the same barcode apparently. Um, and they're all registered, so I squash it down so it fits in the machine, that one. Um, but yeah, even the same as if you get a two litre bottle over here, um, <coughs> excuse me, uh, they will go through. But then what I'm going on about is the size. So you might get a whole heap of big plastic bottles and that sort of thing where it takes up more room than what the glass does. So sometimes you get more glass than what you do cans. So, and that's where your load comes into consideration too. Um, so we got a bit of steel over there. We've got uh, four gas cans, a bit of wire down here, some aluminium foil, uh, traveling jug, 12 volt, bit of, bit of electrics there. Um, these two chairs on the side, they were just a, almost a pick, uh, driving past the dumpster and yeah, seen them there. I thought, nah, bugger, I'm gonna pick them up. So I'll take them home, show June, see what she see what she thinks of them, and uh, we'll decide after that. But anyway, let's get into these wine bottles and uh, whiz the tops off. This one's just a funny one. No bum. He was already broken. So we'll just get him done first. It's definitely gonna be a one and done this one. Got nowhere else to go today. So, yes, yeah, she's only one and done. How about we just whiz the tops off first, like I usually do. Tops off that one, tops off that one, tops off that one. Damn insects, come around the side here. Well, we'll just do you quickly, maybe not. Whiz you off, come on, let's tight that one. Yellow tail, never heard of that one. Oh yes, I have yellow tail, yeah, it's locally, that one. That down there. So is this a local? I think. Not sure. I know the yellow tail is local. Not real fond of wine. Spirits, yes. Not wine. Not a wine drinker. Don't slip and miss, brother. Come on, brother. Go down with this one. Get up there, son. Give it the split. There we go. Off with your neck. This one here. Bit of a toss of the knife. Come on. There we go. Off with its neck. 
these are the easy ones, they're not that tight. Jacob's Creek. Yes, I've heard of that one before. There. Over there. Is that a camper going? No. Don't look like a camper to me. Everyday blow Joe fisherman. That looks like a vinegar. Oh, aluminium tops. Yeah, that's all right. Right, like this one here, we just gotta peel that off. Peel that off. Over there. Same as that. Done. Right, well, we haven't done too bad. Geez, that's some good wire. That's good stripping wire, that one. Um, got an iPhone cord in there as well. Ooh, a bit more wire, a bit more aluminium. Better sort that out. So if you've enjoyed tagging along with me today, uh, like, subscribe, and uh, definitely see you in the next one. So until then, happy dumpster diving, and stay safe out there, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheerio.